Hello, universe. Welcome to my world. Recently, we were speaking to a teenager who'd just been introduced to Angelina Jordan, and she suggested that Angelina would be more popular among her generation if she did more on TikTok. Actually, she does do a lot on TikTok, and we do look at a lot of her TikTok performances, and that's what we're doing today. Her TikTok performances may not be the crown jewels of her talent, but they are the little gems of her talent. And we look at these little gems one by one. And today we're looking at Angelina Jordan's performance of a Rihanna song, Only Girl in the World. But before we hear Angelina Jordan, we go for the full panorama of many different singers in many different styles, just to understand the breadth and depth of how a song can be approached. We're going to start by listening to Ellie Goulding. She's a British singer and she's performing in BBC Studio. And the first five performances we're going to hear are going to go from standard to more and more unorthodox. So Ellie Golding will give us a good standard performance in the studio with her backing musicians. Make me feel like I'm the only girl in the world. Like I'm the only one that you'll ever love. Like I'm the only one who knows your heart. Only girl in the world. Cause I'm the only one that's second command. Cause I'm the only one Next, we're going to Florida, and we're going to hear an acoustic cover by Boyce Avenue. We've heard them several times before. A completely different feel from Ellie Golding's version. I want to make you feel like you're the only girl in the world. Like you're the only one that I'll ever love. Like you're the only one who knows my heart. Next, we're going to Manchester, England, and we're meeting Autopilot, also known as Matt Hutchison. Manchester historically has had quite a music scene. We've had Richard Ashcroft in The Verve. We've had Oasis. And we even had The Smiths. Do you remember The Smiths? And when we listen to Autopilot, he actually does... Remind me a little bit of Richard Ashcroft of The Verve. His version is acoustic rock. Wanna make you feel like you're the only girl in the world. Like you're the only one that I never loved. Like you're the only one who knows my heart. Only girl in the world. Like you're the only one to see in command. Like you're the only one. Next, we're going to Brazil, and surprise, surprise, we're going to hear a bossa nova version. This is Alana Marie. And the most unconventional one we will hear is from Mike Tompkins from Canada. His version is known as Voice and Mouth. It reminds me a little bit of Beatbox. Do you remember Beatbox? <laughs> And when we hear Mike Tompkins, we'll hear a little bit about how this video was put together to get more of an appreciation of how the voice and mouth version goes.
Next, we're going to hear a couple of jazz versions. This is where it starts to get interesting because Angelina Jordan herself gives a very jazzy performance of this song, which we'll hear in a few minutes. But hers and the two other jazz performances are all very different. It's amazing how different these three jazz performances are. This is Monica Borsim from Poland. The next jazz version we will hear is from the Overtones. They have a very interesting story. They were working on a building site, singing while working, and some music producer heard them, and that is how their career took off. Moral of that story is, you never know what fate has in store for you. This version is very jazzy and, and moves along really well. I'm gonna make you feel like you're the only girl in the world. Like you're the only one that I've ever loved Like you're the only one that knows my heart Only girl who I love Like you're the only one that's in command Cause you're the only one that understands How to make me feel like a man Before we hear Rihanna's original version, which is a dance version, there are three other dance versions which we will hear. First, we will go to Finland and we will meet Deandra. She originally had her start of her career on a Finnish talent show. And then we will hear Tori Kelly. She's also performing on a talent show, but sometimes to catch the attention of your audience, you do need to be a bit gimmicky. And the gimmick today is in the form of a seahorse and two cacti. Seriously, yes, we're about to see a seahorse and two cacti. Next two dance performances. First, we will hear Ariana Grande in the start of a career. This is in 2011 when she's performing at an ice skating competition. And then we will hear Rihanna's original.
Inevitably, we finish with Angelina Jordan. And this is another example of how she has a completely different interpretation from everyone else. We've heard a couple of other jazz performances, and hers is jazzy, but it's different. Every line, every word has a different spin, has a different feel to it. It's amazing how she approaches a song in order to reinvent it. Let's see what we're talking about. Why won't you make me feel I'm the only girl in the world I come the only one that you ever love I come the only one that knows you We're very lucky that we have all these little gems from Angelina via TikTok. They don't need to be long. Sometimes she may convert one to a longer performance. But it's our way of saying, thank you for your appreciation. This is what I do, and this is how I do it. We will continue to look at what Angelina Jordan does in the future. Okay, gang, I'm out of here. I'll catch you later. Bye.